<laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. 2023 has been um 2023 has been a bittersweet journey for me as a human being and um 2023 made me realize that when you want something you will get it but you will have certain situations in your way and you have you have to like make sure you are on track or else you're just going to lose track so 2023 was a year of me being a student an art student and it wasn't it wasn't difficult it wasn't i mean it was difficult but it had its advantages attached to it it was at the beginning of it it was very new to me because i am not used to the the traditional system of schooling i'm not used to the the crowd and the people around and like learning from other people i'm not used to that i'm used to one-on-one -on -one thing so it was very difficult for me at the beginning but as time went on i sacked myself that i need to adjust and it's working um a work in progress when it comes to that because yeah my course is very demanding and my course is very um practical so if i don't do what i'm supposed to do as an art student i will fail and that's what made it very difficult because me the for me i was not getting time to do so many things but i made sure that i do i i get to a particular standard of doing the work it's better than doing it halfway than not doing it at all when it comes to art as a student so that's what i tried my i tried my possible best to like make sure i'm doing my every assignment even though i didn't miss any assignment most of the assignments that i had some of them a percentage of them weren't so completed but like i made sure i did it and it got to a point i was not even getting time for myself i was not um taking care of my body I wasn't taking care of my myself, my mental self and my mental, I mean, my mental self and then my physical self. I wasn't taking care of anything like that. Not even family. I wasn't taking care of anything. All I cared was about my school, my assignments, my exam. If I'm going to fail, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do that. So at the middle of it, it was very difficult for me as a student. Yeah school and family bringing these two together when it comes to your university level is very it, it makes you now understand that you are a grown person and now makes you understand that like life is going to get to you so you get prepared for it that is how it is when you are a student in the university i don't know for other people but like for me that is what it feels like and i i mean my mom grew and uh, my mom um trained my brother and i in such a way that we are not going to be so surprised about anything i mean if someone comes and gives me money i i know the money is going to finish one day so i'm not going to be so surprised but i'm just going to appreciate it so we are trained to appreciate what we have than to be surprised about what is happening around you so so these two family and school i know that they are aware that i want to do well in school and they also want me to do well in school but our relationship is also important so we try our possible best to be intact be in contact with each other and all of that so it was it was not easy. I can call my mom and cry. And my mom would be like, it's okay. I wouldn't talk. I would sh 
she, and she understands what I'm going through because she knows the kind of child she um, gave birth to. And the things I have experienced as a student throughout my educational career and me being away from being far away from home, she also understands that. And it's, it wasn't it wasn't an easy decision for her to allow me to go all the way to Kumasi to school. It wasn't an easy decision for her, but I mean, I'm not going to my second year, so yeah. <laughs> At the end of it all, I I enjoyed the beginning and the end. It feels like watching a movie. My my educational um, career last year was like a movie for me. I'm not going to lie to you guys. It was like a movie because I, I was aware of the beginning and I was aware of the end. Right? So I knew that there's a beginning and there's an end. And the fact that it's my new, like, it's a new environment I'm in. So it is very easy for me to recall what happened at the beginning and what happened at the end. And how I've grown as a person and how I've grown with um, talking to people. I have really improved with um, talking to people, opening up to people, um, smiling. I mean, I'm trying my best to smile to people as well. I get a lot of opinions i i know parents i mean ugh. i know opinions aren't facts but i believe as a person when someone tells you something and another person tells you something and it keeps going on and on you should know that there's a problem because everybody's opinions aren't the same but if it's the same then is there's a problem somewhere so you have to correct it. so that's what i'm trying to correct and i'm trying to be a nice person and i believe i'm a nice person as well so yeah and i believe that so at the beginning of the year i was very expectant of what i came to do in school i was expecting that things are going to be difficult for me i was expecting it i knew it because i know what art feels like i mean i don't know everything but like i know how it can feel like but the level of um tiredness i got in school i i didn't expect to be that high and i really enjoyed it i made sure i enjoyed each and every bit of it i made sure that i made friends i made sure that i i took my study seriously even though i didn't pass every every exam i still pass exams <laughs> I still passed the courses. I was, okay, I didn't fail any course. Let me just say that. I didn't fail any course. But I didn't um, do all the way I was expecting. But obviously, what I got would be somebody's great, like somebody's um, expectations or somebody's goal for their exam. But to me, I wanted something higher. And obviously, I did better than a lot of people. But at the end of the day, it is me. I came to the school alone and I know what I want, right? So, the my educational career last year was, it was, it was a movie, okay? I met people. I expressed myself to people. And I realized that something was taken away from me. Something was, I mean, there are good parts and then there are bad parts. When you overshare, when you overthink certain things, when it comes to like friends, right? And honestly, my first year of art school was a movie. I don't know how to explain this, but it was a movie because the things I wasn't expecting to achieve, I achieved it and because i am not so surprised about anything i just acknowledge the fact that i got opportunities to do certain things i've been able to exhibit at three places i've been able to exhibit at three places and these places are places that some people that are even higher than me or are my seniors in school haven't exhibited there yet and it's an achievement for me because I want to be a prominent artist. So 
I feel like this this step I'm taking to come to the arts university is very important to me as an artist. I've been able to exhibit at the EU residence. I've been able to exhibit at Jandu's place, and I've been able to exhibit at the National Museum. And these places are these places are good places. I mean, they are places. You should understand what I'm saying. And I didn't get the opportunity to even document anything. Okay, if I documented things, that's for my oh, on my Snapchat. <laughs> well, like I didn't even get the opportunity to document for YouTube because I didn't get the time to do that. And I realized that what you make time for. You will have the time to do it and i made sure that i had time to finish every assignment i had time to like do something about my education that was that's what my mind my mind wasn't on youtube once in a while i'll be like mm, i need to vlog and one time i need to like just vlog a day in my life as an art student and blah 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 but honestly anything that just come your way when you're in school and it's 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 going to be very cringe to vlog in my department over there you no know? but i don't know maybe if you go there if we go next year i mean 2024 my second year if i go and this is better then i will vlog but i i just want you to know that so this is my first video ever since i went to school so this is my first video ever since i went to school and i don't know i feel different i don't feel like a child i used to feel like a child but i don't feel like a child anymore but i am not so grown and the, my experiences in school have built some level of confidence in me as well i'm not going to lie i have become very confident as compared as as compared to my previous years i become more confident and it's positive right so i feel like i'm a new person now i feel like i'm a different person now my taste to certain things have changed my perspective i was saying things has also changed my understanding with certain things has also changed so i'm a different person i would say and this is officially my first video for 2022 i hope i'll be able to make more videos because i've realized that documenting certain things is very important to see your growth as a human being so i promise myself to be consistent it's part of my new year resolutions to be very consistent with youtube and i don't know where god wants to take me to but i know he's going to take me to a very beautiful land a very good place in my life that i'm going to be proud of and my enemies are even going to be proud of me so yeah isaiah 55 verse 8 it says my thoughts are not your thoughts uh, isaiah 55 this 8 says my thoughts are nothing like your thoughts says the lord and ways are far and my ways are far beyond anything you can imagine so obviously the way he thinks about me is not the way i think about myself so i pray to god that he makes me think the way he thinks of me if that makes sense it does and i also know that and i know that his ways are way 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 better than anything that I can imagine. The way I think that God is going to take you to a particular level, I know that His own is better, way, way better than mine. So I'm just going to put my trust in God and just see where I end up. 
as an artist in a human being thanks for watching this video i really appreciate it if you push up to the end of it and happy new year